In this lesson, we'll review in identifying the error problem. It's part of the writing multiple choice. We're on page 472, question 28, and this is a level 5 problem. Neither Miss Perez nor Miss Tanaka believes that watching as much television as her son Sam does will lead to anything productive. So we obviously just have to identify the error, but I always recommend to think about what the correct version should be to reinforce the the error and confirm hopefully your correct answer choice. So here in the beginning we've got neither Miss Perez nor neither nor is a correlative conjunction. Whenever there's a neither, there must be a nor. And we have parallel parts, these two names immediately after. Nothing wrong. Then we have believes. Now believes is a regular verb. It's not it's not a to be verb like is, are, was, were. So if we add the S this is a singular verb if we drop it it's plural and I think a lot of students make the mistake here seeing two names here and then changing the verb to believe and just stopping right there we've talked about this in previous lessons the only conjunction the only way that you can possibly connect two singular subjects to make them plural is and if it's not an and it is always singular so let's also think about it neither one neither miss Parak Perez nor Miss Tanaka. Neither one believes is correct. It's singular. There's no and. That watching as much sun television as her son Sam does, does will not lead to anything productive. Will lead. Nothing wrong with that. And this is really a pretty obvious error if you're familiar with the rules. Her is ambiguous. To whom does, does Sam belong? We don't know. You can't simply infer it. And anytime two names are listed in the sentence, you see a pronoun, it's going to be the ambiguous pronoun. You need to re replace her and put the name of the, the parent to correct it. The answer here is C. And this should be ambiguous, not A. All right. See you next time. Thanks for watching.